Hey guys. <clears throat> Sorry, just got back from eating. Hey guys, I'm Dr. Jupiter. And welcome back to Stevie Universe Phantom Fable. Now, by the time you guys are watching this video, I'm... I'm gonna be... I'm probably gonna be vacationing with family. I'll be, uh... Gone for... From the 20th to the 24th, I believe that's what they said. But during that time, I release a new one, one or two, <clears throat> one video each day during that time. And if I'm feeling, if I'm feeling generous, I'm, I might just. I might just record a second video to add to that day. Basically, right now I'm... Basically, right now I'm just... Recording videos... <clears throat> I mean, I can't speak. I'm pre- I'm pre-recording videos. Probably like five videos, so I could... Have them up and ready, so I could post each day during the vacation, so I don't leave you guys without any content during that time. But anyway, we're back to to Phantom Fable. And I think I, and I saw this on YouTube. I think I figured out how we could deal with this guy. The focus, hot focus. Yes. The guy's two finger. Crap, I can't get through the fire. Got it. Crap, I missed it. Got it. Don't stay on defensive. Deep pearl. Crap! <sighs> Basically, guys, it turns out we gotta throw Pearl's beard through the fire in order and right at the guy in order to do any lasting damage. I mean, at least we know we'll hurt him, but the problem is we still have to we have to do that while avoiding the lasers, those electric fluorine spike things. And we have to do that Z that Z tracing thingy thing too. Yeah, that too. Plus 
with the mechanics of this game, these controls, the controls are like, I just can't work with them. Two fingers to shoot the spear. I mean, I get it, but at the same time, it makes it hard to aim. Like, how am I supposed to aim it like that? But hey, we're gonna have to try. I may not talk my during this boss battle because I need to focus. So there's that. Sorry, Steven. Well, there's gotta be a way to aim. Come on! How am I supposed to aim this thing with these freaking controls? Let's try again. I think I can do a stay on defense. Okay, this tracing is not easy. I'm telling you guys that now. Uh, do, do, do they expect me to get it perfectly? Kinda hard to do if you can't see the tracing over your thumb. Come on! Crap, pros down, guys down the fence. Come on, aim, 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 aim! 
Um, uh, I'm not paying for this one. Got it! Finally! Any second and I would've been out of here. Or I would've just raged quit. Whichever comes first, really. It's her. She... She was the monster. You... Eh. She was just left here, discarded like an object, like a thing. That's rough. This is how Homo treats those pearls. They they always have. Okay, that's just a new. Okay, I know this is technically canon, so I so I should already be aware of this. But I'm just gonna say it again. Homo's treatment of pearls is just. A new, more glorified version of slavery. I mean, I get it. I mean, I get it. I mean, w watching Steven Universe. Well, and and not <sighs> watching Steven Universe and not Steven Universe Future before Future, and before the main canon. I I mean, I understand that. Gems don't exactly have the same, you know, values as humans, you know, family, friends, you know, the usual stuff, but, but, but treating, but treating lore gems like objects and weapons and basically things, pretty much. There's just some things that shouldn't be allowed. Pearl! Pearl, I'm so sorry. They were wrong about you and about her. A pearl taught me that I could be as strong as I choose to be. Well... That's insp inspiring. So inspiring that I'm not gonna bring up the fact that most of Connie's wins are usually are usually are you <clears throat> are usually by the help of someone else. Yeah, yeah, guys, I'm not even gonna try to sugarcoat it. I mean, I mean, the Sworn to the Sword was a good episode, but with all the sword training. Wouldn't it make sense to at least let Connie win- Let Connie do one solo fight? I mean, guys. I mean, I'm not trying to- And before you guys get me in the comments, No, I'm not taking shots at Connie, and no, I'm not trying to- Put down her character, I'm just saying. I, I mean, I'm just saying what I saw. With the with those cluster gems at the hospital, Jasper and that corrupted gem, per that sparring battle with Pearl in Sworn to the Sword. I have not seen Connie do one fight solo, like um, Rebecca. If you're gonna make Connie a sword fighter, at least let her do one solo fight. But that's my opinion. You did very well. Thank you, ma'am.
that was exhausting. So much that I was mixing up my words. <laughs> Mayor Doofy. Pearl, welcome back. Hey, you okay? You look kind of crumpled. What's with that face? I'm... Yes, I'm fine. No, I'm out of that... Out of there. We met Pearl. One who had been left alone for a long time. We must be careful. I'm grateful to Steven and Connie for helping me escape. Were I forced to suffer the same fate as her? Cool! It's okay, Pearl. You're safe now. Now where am I, now where do, now where do we go from here? Hi Lion, who's my favorite boy? <sighs> okay guys. I'm gonna tell you now. Steven you after the main series there are well, after the main series and all the way of, well, all the way of seeing you in the future, there are so many unexplored plot lines that should have been explored more, you know? Like that chest in Lion's Main. How, why didn't we ever find out what was in it? There's, they showed Steven trying to well, attempting to put that large key in the hole of it, but it didn't work. So it obviously had some importance, yet we never found out what it was. And business. Notice how she has a completely new form and future. When did, when did that happen? I'm telling you guys. The universe future left so many unexplored plot lines, and it's a shame that we never got to explore them. But again, that's just my opinion. Speak speaking of chess, let's see what's behind let's see what's in this one. Shoot, it's locked. To unlock this chest and earn a special reward, collect all essential pieces. Uh, okay, narrator. Hey, Greg. What's up, Stewball? Wow, so that book really did grab the gym, huh? Right, and we've got to save them. Well, if you need anything, I'll be here. That goes for you too, Miss Mahathorn. So, hey Pearl, any idea where I go from here? Hello, Stephen, Connie. The books were known to manipulate the truth, but it felt so real. Hmm. I'm, I surmise that the book placed the gems in their respective chapters because it related specifically to them. I wonder why, if they're trying to file them into a category, giving them a task to complete, or just toying with them. Uh, not to think about it. That's actually a good question. I mean, why would? I mean, was the book? I remember them. I think they said the book was made by someone on Homeworld. Why would they get the book that feature? Yeah, probably, yeah, it was probably made by White Diamond just to mess with him. We knew how, we all saw how White Diamond is. Do you have any idea why I didn't capture Connie or me? Well, you're the first gym human hybrid to exist, Steven. And Connie, who knows if it's ever seen a human before? Maybe I didn't know what to do with you. Let's see how much. Huh, only 20 minutes. I guess we could squeeze it a bit more. 
<laughs> Mayor Doofy. Oh, also, with that being said, okay, speaking of which, how many of you guys, guys, re remember Dewey Wins? I gotta know. If you guys were in the episode Dewey Wins, who are you, who would you vote for? Mayor Dewey or Mayor Nefa? Me? I'd vote for I'd vote for Mayor Nefa all throughout the episode. No offense to Dewey, but that dude is really incompetent. I mean, where was he when people were getting kidnapped? Also, what was I about to say? Mm. But yeah, think about it. Look how much initiative Nanfa was taking as mayor. She had she had a telescope at the White House to see any galactic threats. She set up alarms for these for an invasion. The whole shebang. Okay, does it Come on, hitting it! What the heck? I'm hitting it! I was hitting it! What was that? <laughs> Doofy! I can find a place that gives gives me more. I hope I can find one of those juice boxes to get more health. Cause that really already took up two hearts. See guys, right now my main complaint about the game is the freaking controls. Like, would have been too much to add like a I don't know, an analog pad or D-pad function on the screen. Cause these controls are just clunky. I mean, I think that's a word. I mean, I mean these touch movement controls, they just don't do it with me. But hey, if you, that's your thing, more power to you. Huh, where am I going from here? That Mayor Doofy. <laughs> um, that's never gonna stop being funny. Oh, come on, there has to be a clue where, where I'm going next. Crap, I did the game bugging. Guys, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. The, but the game was bugging, so I had to restart. But I think I found where we're going next. Hey, I mean, look, Monster Prince. Mayor Ronaldo was, on, was actually onto something. Look, Steven, there are some leaves in print. Wait, Ronaldo? I didn't talk to Ronaldo. Was that in another episode? I'll just have to look at it later. These leaves are natural to anything that grows on a peach. Oh, Mayor Monster lives in the woods. Good thinking, Steven. We should search the woods for more clues.
Dang it. This tie is too far in. We can't go any further. So I basically came out this way for nothing. Great. Guys, I'm going to pause recording until we get to the next objective. Where that is. Hey guys, I'm Dr. Jupiter and welcome back to po uh, the Steven Universe Phantom Fable. Ugh. Okay guys, I'm a little frustrated right now because, uh, this is not actually a first recording. I, I already had 20 minutes of recording earlier, but my, my freaking screen recording software decided to loop, crash, and I lost 20 minutes of the original recording. That includes the boss fight. And, and pretty much any dialogue after that. 20 minutes of footage just gone. This is just ridiculous. Uh, I guess I gotta do my announcement all over again. Oh, on the 20th, by the time you're watching this, I'll probably, I'll most likely be on vacation with family. But, in order to rectify this, I'm gonna post one video for each other day, each day during the vacation. The vacation will go from the 20th to the 24th, so from the 20th to the 24th, expect one video each day. If I'm in the mood, I might record. Record. I might pre record two extra videos to add to the five if I'm in the mood. But uh, yeah, let's continue. We defeated the boss. We defeated the boss. That gave me trouble the last episode. Turns out, I had to do that. Tracy thing with the you know with that I had to do this and I had to uh, you know draw patterns to light those torch things before throwing at the bug thing it gave me a way to defeat the boss but it did make it easier since it kept spawning in those electric spikes and kept shooting lasers and plus, let's just look. How do I aim this? See, huh. with these controls, it's hard to aim. Anyway, back to the story. Where I, where it is. <coughs> Here it is. I think. You found the Berry Bastion chapter. You can now enter it to help Garnet.
Oh, I guess we don't even get a choice. We just enter right away. Well, well, let's find on it. Well, first, let's see if we can find a juice box in these things. Cause I might need a little bit more health. Darn it! Darn it! Ah, there she is. Garnet. Garnet, thank goodness we found you. It was very dangerous for you to follow me here. Like we're just gonna let you get in by a book. Let's do this. Oh, all right, let's go. Garnet has joined the group. To save her from this chapter allow her to leave, you must complete the chapter of the Buried Bastion. You rescued two of the Crystal Gems. Great job. Simply draw their unique glyphs to summon them instantly. Um, you guys show us their unique glyphs? Hello, you guys show us? What are their glyphs? <sighs> I guess we'll get to that part of the story. So I guess all the way till the tutorial shows us. Those rocks are blocking the path. Leave it to me. Wait, what's down here? Forget how you ask, forget how you ask. Wait, hold on, I gotta get that bug, uh, get that thing. Yeah. Ooh, a collectible. Wait, what is this? Okay, this is just broken. Come on! Okay, these... These minion... These goons are getting hard to hit. It's not even better with these controls. Sheesh.
Wow, I'm already low on health. Great. Okay, guys. Okay, there's gotta be a juice box around here somewhere. Oh, oh, I forgot these were a thing around here. This works perfectly. And I think I just got this health. Uh oh. -uh. Come on. I just got this health. Come on! And I just got this health. That block. I can let it and move it. There. Seriously? Really? Okay, this is stupid. I'm doing it. You gotta be kidding me! I'm doing the thing, Jesus! A 
Okay, who do okay, who made this game? Okay, whoever made the controls for this game, fire him. Someone please fire that guy. Fire him. I'm doing it! I'm doing it! I'm doing it right now! Dang it! Oh, screw this. I'm out of here. Ugh, Gia became me. I swear. This game's gonna give me exact. Give me a headache. I'm pressing it. I'm I'm doing a thing. What's wrong with this stupid thing? Ugh. I just lost 20 minutes of recording two times. Not one. Not once. Two. Twice. How does the freaking software lose the recording twice? <sighs> Once again, hey everyone, I'm Dr. Jupiter, and welcome back to Steven Universe Phantom Fable. First off, I just lost 20 minutes of recording twice. First, it was the boss fight. Second, it was finding Garnet. <sighs> I swear. I'm going to catch an aneurysm at this point. I am this close to rage quitting. But anyway, between announcements. By the time you wish you're watching this video, I'm probably on vacation right now. I'm going to be on vacation with the family in Merle Beach for, from the 20th to the 24th. But I'll post one video each day during that time, so... So as to not leave you guys without any content, in case I feel in the mood to record something. Or I get an idea of what I'm sending to record. But let's get on this video before this... Before I lose the recording of this too. And of course I went the wrong way. I just gotta run. I ain't wasting his health. In case you're wondering what I'm doing this guys 
is because apparently I had to do like this so Garnet can move the freaking thing. Freaking box over here. But apparently for some reason it's just not working. <sighs> okay, I said it's in the two recordings that got lost that just crashed. But I really hate the controlling in this game. It makes it hard to move. It makes it hard to attack. To move. To solve puzzles. To basically do anything on this game. Where made the where came up the idea for the controls for this game? They just need to be fired. Here, 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 right here, Garnet, right here. <sighs> now it wants to work. <sighs> okay, this game's getting frustrating, you guys. The controls, one thing, but we're recording going out several times. It's really trying my patience. <sighs> Look, I'm just gonna try recording after 20 minutes of recording, and then I'm just gonna stop because. I have RV. I have to record five videos in one go. Oh, not this guy again. Okay, you guys don't understand. Once this guy hits the ground, it's basically hard to get to attack with normal attacks. And that's just frustrating. I literally had to hit a pattern. Hit a pattern with that tracing thing just to be able to attack him with regular attacks. Ugh, it just gets so annoying. Uh, of course, there's puzzles. Sure, why not? At this point, of course, there's freaking puzzles.
Really? What can I even do here? I swear, this I think it's, this game's starting to get frustrating with all these controls, all these stupid puzzles. Okay, at this point, Garnet, you might as well just yeet it, yeet it over there. I know you can. You can do this type of stuff in the show. Well, at least we they got that right. What'd you say? The rubies? Eyeball? You've met them before? Yeah, we beat them at baseball at Center of Neptune. Uh. You what? Trust me, as unbelievable as it sounds, it actually happened. Hmm. What is it, Garnet? Future vision? Past. I married this old. These movies should match, but the uniforms are all different. Is it possible a book is using your memories to change how these events unfold, Garnet? Perhaps. Rui, fall in. Are uh, you sure their outfits are different? They look the same. Grr, I hate this planet. There's some just sand in my shorts. Yeah, stupid earth. Be dirt or be water, not both. Quiet, we're here for the mission, remember? Yes, Ruby, what is our objective? Again? Our mission is the abstraction of sensitive data from the facility below. We must not allow it to fall into rebel hands. This sounds dangerous. I hope it is dangerous. Well, it will be. Good. Danger. Alright, Platoon, into the facility. These rubies. The book poured them here. Why? We should follow them. Let's go. Okay, guys. It's two days later. Turns out, the recording didn't, didn't cut out. Okay, it did, but the okay, recording did cut out multiple times, but none of the recordings got lost. Just ain't just anything after the minutes that were recorded got lost. So anything after the minutes that got recorded, gone. I guess there must be a bug that kept. The recorded bits from showing in the recorder. So I guess I was just overreacting. But guys, get this thing. With the recording software I use, if the recording cuts out, that's it. Video's gone. So excuse me for overreacting, but anyways. Thanks for watching. I think I might take a break from recording after this. Just saying. H hold on. Uh -huh. So after this, I think I might take a break. Yep, definitely take a break. Thanks for watching. 
please leave a like, comment, share, and subscribe, and click the bell notification so you'll be notified of any new videos. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, YouTube.